Welcome back to another video guys, it is JG Fish Kevin here and today's video is actually a new fish for this tank. So, um, I just got this fish today. Yes, I know this tank may look a little dirty. Um, and it's crystal clear water, it's just, the, I don't know what's wrong. Like, I've, I've got a new filter for this tank. Like, I didn't do a video on it, but that's the new filter, Fluval, uh, Aqua Clear 70. It's a beautiful filter. Um, but yeah, um, I don't know why it's not clear yet. I'm going to try to see uh, what I can do to make this thing clear. I got a product. Maybe, hopefully it'll work. And yeah, so let's check out this new fish that I got. So the new fish is in this bag right here. So this new fish is... This new fish is a red belly paku. I don't know if you guys can see it, but yeah, this is a red belly paku. May look like a piranha or a silver dollar, but nope, it's a red belly paku. Um, beautiful fish. Um, it's gonna be going in the 55. Uh, and yeah, so let's start acclimating this awesome looking fish we got here. So first, we're gonna throw the bag on the floor. So now that this is empty up here, we're gonna open this. Throw that in there and bam. So now we got the fish acclimating in there. Uh, this fish should be fine because the alligator gar may try to mess with it, not sure. Alligator gar shouldn't because it's a fast moving fish and it's nice and like tall, not long and skinny. So yeah, uh, the fish is gonna be come down now. So let me turn off the light. But yeah, the fish is gonna be in there. Uh, gonna let it acclimate. It's coming. It's coming down right now. So you guys, you guys may think it's dead. No, it's not. Just trying to calm down. But I'm gonna let it acclimate, and uh, see you guys when it's done acclimating. And remember, 15 to 20 minutes for the fish to acclimate. So see you guys in 15 to 20 minutes. So welcome back. It's been 15 minutes. So, the fish is done acclimating. So now, I'm just gonna put it inside the tank, and I'm gonna show you guys. Uh, I'm gonna show you guys it inside the tank. So, so fish is all acclimated. I don't know if you guys can see it, but it's all the way back there. Um, so I'll do a little update for you guys. Here is the alligator gar, and then there's the red tiger Oscar. But yeah, that's the Paku right there. Um, I'll be doing soon the uh, videos on uh, how to take care of all these fish for you guys. I feel like that'll be such a good video. And yeah, so that's the Paku. And um, that's the whole entire tank for now. I don't think I'll put it, I don't think I'm putting any more fish in here. I feel like it's fully stocked now. I do have one fish that I don't want to show you guys yet. Um, it's a pretty cool fish, but um, I'm trying to see if I see anything, but uh, yeah, that's all I have for you guys today. Uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, this fish, if you guys were wondering, was, uh, where would it go? It's probably went all the way in the back, but this fish was $14 if you guys were wondering. So I don't know if it's cheaper where you guys are, or just the same exact price, or more expensive. But yeah, if you want to get that fish. It grows pretty big, so you guys have to have a pond or something for it. Um, such as the alligator guard goes big as big as well. Um, so yeah, so you guys make sure to have a pond for all these um, of all these fish. Never keep them inside a tank this small. If like for the whole entire life, I'm keeping them in this just for them to grow and um, showcase them. But yeah, uh, that's the rest. Of this this is my whole fish tank. And uh, more videos come to come soon. Make sure to like, make sure to subscribe, click of two buttons, and it helps me so much. And yeah, hopefully you guys enjoy this video, and uh, JJ Fish keeping out.